Okay, welcome back to more Mega Man Maker. We are playing through Illusion Man by Mega Rocket 2020, a forum posted stage, and yeah, he actually requested that I play this level, so yeah. I was actually going to play this one at some point. Um, I have been eyeing it over on the forums. Uh, I just never got to it, or well, I have I just <laughs> haven't gotten to it. Yeah, basically, but yeah, I was definitely gonna play this one at some point. It looked quite nice during the sc uh, screenshot, so yeah. I definitely knew I wanted to try this one out at, you know, yeah, <laughs> one point or another. Let's see here. Um, I might be a little bit boned here. Uh, dude, that was... Uh, <laughs> I don't know how I squeezed down by that, huh? Very, very tight. And yeah, I think we're gonna make this level A stage showcase pack here. I have a few stages that I know are a bit shorter, and we might just start with this one at the very... Uh, Oh, <laughs> at the very beginning of the video here. Holy crap, dude. <gasps> oh, oh my god, dude, I only saw... I only saw the spikes down there in the right corner and I thought it would fall on them, so that's why I rushed over to the left there. Jeez. Well, let's just cut back. Okay, <laughs> back here again. Now, now that we know what's gonna happen, we're gonna be a little bit more careful down here. And yes, he said there, um, we're gonna make a little showcase pack here, so... Yeah, we're gonna... Ooh, dude, this is uh, so nerve-wracking. Uh, we're gonna add on some more stages here behind. I do have some short levels that I want to get to here, and... Jeez, <laughs> I did not pay attention. For some reason I thought I would fall down on the green one, but yeah, um, we do have some stages that I want to go through today, so... Yeah, hopefully we get some nice stages to play here. This one is pretty cool so far. I just keep uh, tripping up here and uh, very start for some reason, but yeah, um, I don't really know there. Like, I thought I would fall... Yeah, I, I'm not really sure why I died, actually. Like, I I looked on the green uh, stroke of colors there, and I thought I was safe when falling there, but yeah, I, I don't know. I don't really know what happened, and now I talked well, my whole trick back here, so I guess <laughs> this is how we're gonna keep it. Okay. Oi, oi, oi. Oh. Yeah, that is actually kind of nutty how it's, you know, all the way to the left. I would probably suggest having that one at least, you know, a bit more to the middle. That's just, like, crazy how far over to the left it is. But yeah, let's cut back. See you there in a sec. Ooh, okay, back here again. Now I'm just gonna jump here. You see, like, you gotta go, like, at the very start. I don't think... Oh, that's a very good way of doing it. <laughs> it's, like, almost too far away. Oh, well, it, uh, yeah, I, I don't feel like the first one there should have been at least... At the very least in the middle. That's just kind of cruel, like, it's... I don't know how you would do that on your first playthrough. <laughs> that's just insane. You just gotta, like, jump to the left and I hope it's gonna spawn it. Oh well, not a big deal, I guess. We're just gonna move on through here. Ooh, uh, I s well, no, I got it. Very nice. Very good checkpoint placement there, though. I will say that, because that room was pretty tricky. Although, eh, I mean, once you know how to do that room, it's not so bad anymore. Ooh, when... Huh. Are you actually gonna... Pay attention? Yeah, where you can stand here. Like, with how the enemies are moving. That's pretty interesting, actually. So you can see there with the octo batteries. I guess we can walk out like... One or two more pixels. Maybe one more. Yeah. Maybe one more. Yeah. Um... Okay, I don't know what that was about. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Okay, I'll, I'll get serious. Let's see here. And we're back. Okay, let's see. Jump down here. And just sit here and jump. And we're gonna jump up here. And I actually don't know where I'm going. 
now that I think about it. <laughs> um, oh, okay, there was a ladder there. Well, very interesting concept, I will say. And let us try and not shoot these guys if we can help it. Yeah, we're just gonna bypass them. And yeah, another very nice checkpoint placement there. Whoops! And we're just gonna teleport ourselves back up. Okay, see. So yeah, I like this. Um. Whoa. <laughs> But yeah, I liked uh, those uh, disappearing blocks, or those sheep blocks down there, much better than the ones in the starter. Like, they felt a little bit unfair. Those, you know, down on the screen just below. Sure, I mean, it was pretty hard, but... Um, yeah, it, it was all fair and, you know, well-balanced in, in that regard. And actually, this is why... Yeah, that's an illusion block. This one, too. Can we? Uh huh. Well, maybe we want to go here. I hope I won't regret it. Ooh. Huh. So is this the way we want to go? Maybe? Uh, <laughs> hmm. Yeah. We're just gonna... <gasps> We're just gonna go down here and almost kill ourselves. Dude! <laughs> I locked out twice there. And... Oh no. Okay, this one is fake. Uh, this one better be real. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> uh... Hmm. Wait, what? Oh, wait. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, I see. You gotta... Yeah, you gotta move on here. I see, pretty interesting. Now we're just gonna sit here. Make a jump. Okay, see, that was also pretty cool how... Whoa! How both uh, items were used there. Ah, I'm not gonna wait for that. But yeah, see, even that room up there, like, even though it was hard to time it and, you know, think through it all in your head while doing it, you still didn't have to, like... Yeah, I I'm beating a dead horse here, I realize, but, you know... It was all perfectly manageable, like, you could reach everything without feeling like you need to know where it is before you tackle it, so, yeah. Ooh, and this is a very nice layout here. Hmm. Oh, I knew it. Dang it. <laughs> I just knew I screwed that one up. Well... Let's do one more attempt here, and then I gotta take a little break here. My food is about to get done. And we're just gonna YOLO it. And that was a bad idea. <laughs> okay, you know what? I'll, I'll take a short break and we'll be back in a sec. Okay, so we're back here again. Um, yeah, finished eating and I'm all fueled up. So now, naturally, we're gonna kick some ass here. Oh my goodness, dude, that is... Oh wow, we already have a new checkpoint. Well, that was a pretty darn hard room, so yeah, I don't really mind. Okay, yeah, now we go. And jump. Oh, damn, dude. <laughs> that was the worst kind of spawn I could have gotten. Nice, and... Oh, come on, dude. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, okay. We're supposed to slide here. Oh, 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 that's right, that's right. Okay, so that's gonna disappear under us. Well, just gonna go fast. And go. Well... Thank you very much for the frequent checkpoints there. Those were <laughs> pretty darn hard segments, I will definitely say. Oh, we got one of these. Damn it! <laughs> yeah. Thankfully we have a checkpoint, like, 
in between almost everything here. This would have gotten like very tough otherwise. Like if you had to pull all of these off, you know, in a succession, like ten screens apart from each checkpoint, that would have been that would have been insane, quite frankly. Yeah, I probably would have rage quit <laughs> if it was that hard actually. Well, you know, I don't really rage quit, but I would have given up. I would definitely have given up. Let's see here. Focus. Damn it. No! Oh no! <laughs> Dang it. Ooh, okay there. So you can definitely use Rush Coil <laughs> to clear or to make those jumps there a little bit easier. <clears throat> you could have even done it on the third one there. Um, if I just, you know, timed it right there. But yeah, you saw I cleared it. Uh, the Rush Coil can actually be quite helpful in this stage. And yeah, let's see here. We have Smofo here. Let's try and kick his ass. Um, where can I stand? <laughs> I don't remember. Okay, well, I don't think there's any way for me to clear the hollow grain up in the start there, or in the, in the start in the roof. Okay, so yeah, we can see there are two tile gaps there where we can fall. Okay, so I'm going to try and not move around too much here. It's probably a little bit dangerous. I think I'd rather just, yeah do this thing here and you know if it hits me who gives a hoot <laughs> yeah just don't panic against this guy that's the best way of doing it drag him to the corner and finish him off but yeah, that was a pretty nice stage overall um, we'll give it a thumbs up um, the difficulty felt a little bit rough at times um, but you know we still had some yeah interesting gimmick usage there especially um, especially those rooms uh, in the middle there where we started to have the enemies you know going back and forth and revealing where you could stand like I don't think I've seen that before that was pretty interesting yeah Interesting concept there by TechMax121, or as it goes by over on the forums, MegaRock2020, I believe. Let me just check that. So I'm not... Uh, let's see. Yeah, MegaRock2020, okay, yeah. So yeah, um... Anyways, <laughs> I'm, I'm all over the place here. Um, yeah, pretty nice first stage here. Uh, was fun to play, nice visuals as well, so yeah. We're just gonna round it up with that, and we're gonna jump into the next one, um, which is gonna be the sulfur mine, sulfur mines by Boxer Hammer. So yeah, see you there in a sec. Okay, welcome back to more Mega Man Maker. We're playing through the sulfur mines by, uh, what's your name again? Boxer Hammer. <laughs> there we go. Uh, I saw the stage being uploaded in the news queue of, um, well, uh, not a few days ago, a day ago actually, and yeah. It had like 11 upvotes, and I, yeah, I thought, dang, it's in the, you know, news queue, and it has 11 upvotes already, so I checked it out, and yeah, it's pretty, pretty nice level here. Um, as you can see, the tile work is pretty darn nice, and yeah, I really like the entrance to the mines here, like, very nice background transitions, very simple, but very clean looking here. You see that there, we have the drill enemies there, cutting through boxes in this level. I actually did not know that they did that until I played this stage here. Okay. I think you can... Yeah, see, <laughs> if, you just, if you just aim correctly, you can actually take out those brown enemies there without actually making them pop their heads out there, which, yeah. Pretty interesting. And yeah, I tried. I tried it there again, but I failed. But yeah, either way, like, this stage is gonna be pretty darn easy um, all around. Yeah, as you can see, we already have the midway checkpoint here. It's just a nice stroll this level here with some nice 
gimmicks going here, like with these drills here. Hey, you just gotta make sure you dodge them properly, and dang it. <laughs> I believe the Dust Crusher actually takes them out in one shot. I think they have five hit points, I might be wrong. But yeah, the Dust Crusher is a very nice weapon here in this level, and yeah, see so here, we're gonna do this. Yeah, like, pretty cool stuff. Gotta lure that one back there. If you, pay if you pay the attention to the first one there, like the first drill opening up crates, you should be able to figure that one out. Pretty, pretty easily. Let's see what happened in here. Yeah, that's right. Okay, we're gonna do this. Yeah, but like. I don't really know what else there is to say, just a very lovely level, and yeah, I'm not going for this. If that was an E tank, perhaps I would, but yeah, obviously you need to <laughs> send the concrete platform down, and then you gotta, you know, jump down yourself as fast as possible, and jump up on the descending platform there. Yeah, yeah it's just ridiculous. <laughs> it's a lot of acrobatics for a 1-up and a energy refill there. Yeah, see so here we have this again. And we're just gonna do this. I, dude, that was frame perfect. <laughs> that was a clean shot. That was not quite as clean, but okay. Well, just whatever, I guess. And whoa! <laughs> okay, exactly as planned. And we're just gonna do this and run with this guy back. And don't activate that and don't activate this platform either. <laughs> yeah, I actually did that, I believe, when I played, you know, by myself. I actually screwed up, you know, once or twice while running back there. <laughs> oh well, now that I have practiced, or well, practiced, but now that I have played it, I kind of know what I'm doing here. But yeah, like, very nice stage, and I think we're just gonna use the Dust Crusher on the Bowser to speed it up. But yeah, like, very nice stage. Nice visuals, fun like, little gimmick concept there. And, you know, a decent boss room here as well, and I wonder. I think the boss is actually gonna be the best weapon here. Maybe. Eh. Uh. <laughs> oh god, dude, that, that got awkwardly close. But yeah, like, very nice stage. This is gonna be a very <clears throat> short video, actually. Let's see. Yeah, I only played for six minutes. <laughs> well, no, even shorter than that. Five minutes. Five to six minutes. Yeah, very short one. Okay, well, either way, nice stage by Boxer Hammer. Uh, I just wanted to showcase it. I thought the stage was very nice when I played it, and, you know, I thought, yeah. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I just wanted to showcase it. That's pretty much it. Uh, nice visuals, fun enemy placements, and some decent gimmick usage there with the drills, you know. Let's just a very. Well, polished stage. That's really all there is to say. So yeah, good job, Boxer Hammer, on this one. And I will just leave it at that. Thank you guys very much for watching, and have a nice day. All right, and for the last one, we're gonna do this stage by Shiryu Fuyisaki. Um, the stage is called Run, Let's Run. And yeah, from what I was told, this level is gonna be revolving around fleeing from a flame ball. As and, and as you can hear. Yeah, there's definitely a flame ball coming, and yeah, I did try this level out a little bit before going to recording here, just to see, you know, if I wanted to play this or not, and yeah, it seems like a pretty interesting level. Um, yeah, so we have all these little <laughs> trials here, we gotta climb or scale, meanwhile, we're on the timer, and yeah, this is actually as far as I've gotten up to this point here. I have not played more than this, so yeah, hopefully, hopefully we can do this. Um, the stage does seem pretty damn hard, and am I screwed? I might want to do this here again. Let's see. Nice. Okay, that's gonna be much better. Yeah, look at that. Now we can just jump up there and holy crap Sparkman, can you stop it? 
go and run. <laughs> Holy crap! Go! <laughs> huh. Okay. Oh, dude, there is a spike there. <laughs> Why the heck <laughs> is there a spike in the wheel there? <laughs> well, I'm glad I saw it. I mean, it's not that deadly. You can pretty easily avoid it. Even if you do jump up, you're probably not gonna hit it, but still. <laughs> still glad I saw it. I'm running very low on health here. wonder how much... How much there is left? Ooh. Okay. <gasps> huh. Well. <laughs> yeah. We can cheese it. Um. Do that. <gasps> Holy cow. Phew. Glad I didn't die there. Oh, 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 no, we gotta go down. Oh, no. Oh, no. Wait, we have an E-Tank. Hells, yeah, use it. Now, where exactly do we fall here? <laughs> oh, I'm just very scared of running or falling down on a spike. Okay, we made it, we made it, we made it, okay. Cool. So yeah, um... I died once or twice on my little test round there, but yeah, I didn't die on... Here, like, on the real deal. Yeah, very nice. Um, actually kind of happy I it went as smooth as it did. Um, of course, I did cheese at mid part too. Uh, <laughs> you know, I used this C kick there to uh, get myself an extra jump in me there, yeah. But still, you know, a pretty fun... Uh, level concept here by Shi Shuri Fujisaki. I, sorry, I can't pronounce that properly. <laughs> a pretty fun stage concept, once again. Um, pretty bare bones in the visual department, but you know, um, the stage itself, you know, it was it was fun to scale the stage and yeah, watching out for the dangers there. So yeah, pretty nice job all around. So yeah. And I think we will leave it at that for this level showcase. That is three stages now. So yeah. I would just thank you guys so very much for watching and have a nice day!